Shopify is sponsoring today's vlog. <laughs> Thank you. This is what it feels like to not pack at the very last moment in a panic. It's been a while, it's been years, but today I thought, you know, I had a slow afternoon. So I'm getting all of my clothes sorted out and I can do toiletries the same day. I don't actually fly out until tomorrow at 9 p.m. I'm also being mindful of what I want to wear because I used to just really rely on raiding my mom's closet and I feel like my visit back home can feel a lot more just enjoyable overall if I kind of resonate with what I'm wearing like I can express myself whereas in the past I really valued convenience the convenience of mindless packing and light packing so I just go home and wear whatever and end up just like clashing every day and just feeling all very out of sorts I don't think I've ever talked about it on my channel but I have this kind of negative feeling when it comes to going to the Bay Area I think because one I felt really antsy just growing up for the majority of my life there I just want to get out of there like I always felt like oh it was so boring going back home but also it made me realize that a large chunk of my young adulthood was coping with my dad battling cancer so every time I visited for winter break or summer break you know all throughout college and afterwards it was always like with the mental preparation of seeing someone I loved suffer and that put me in maybe a slight or deep depression oftentimes so going home felt very heavy I want to see the Bay Area like my <coughs> sorry like my home don't want to choke on my spit it's starting to become nostalgic and i can reflect on it and see the beauty and in a way reclaim the memories and make them my own so this time around there's a lot of fun occasions to look forward to as well as just like kind of treating the week in between as uh like work from home chill mode work from home and what else I'm gonna be doing a lot of like digital art because I rebooted my Patreon. Thank you for coming along with me. I'm excited. Exciting. <laughs> he was purring. <laughs> Thank you for tolerating that. <laughs> the property manager knocked on my door and said that he was here to change the filters. He's like, we change them every six months. I'm like, huh, because I've been living here definitely over 12 months and no one has ever come to change them. But he was so nice to talk to and he was like, are you a teacher? You look like a teacher. And I'm not like, I'm an artist, but I would love to be a teacher, but I don't have the credentials. <laughs> and then also he was like, is your favorite color pink? <laughs> yes, my favorite color is pink right now. Pink, green, and red. impulsively cut tiny bangs for myself yesterday. I like that it changes things up, but it's quite simple. While out of town and away from the studio, I'll be working on digital art and my website. I started my shop a couple years ago and it's powered by Shopify, so I'm very happy to be sponsored by them today. Shopify is a commerce platform that makes starting and running your own business easy. Whether it's from scratch or you already have an established business, you can sell online or in person. And like for me, I purchased a cool theme and you can have a professional looking website right off the bat. It can be as simple or as complicated as you desire. There are so many merchant focused tools and back end access to the code so you can customize and bring your unique vision to life. Shopify has got a wealth of third party apps so you can install it for cool features features like campaign functions or payment options. I love the user interface. It's intuitive to navigate and collaboration is easy with different permission settings if you have team members. Like last year, I hired help to add some flavor to my site and I certainly plan to do way more very soon. Super excited for you to see. So if you've been meaning to build a site and open that shop you've been dreaming of, don't hesitate. Take that first step right now. It's so easy. Check it out in my link below, shopify.com slash Gao for a free trial. I hope that you have fun and enjoy it like I do. I've got this travel credit card and I pass the, this threshold. I definitely book late night flights like red eyes the very unpreferable times because for the past four times I have flown home to the Bay Area. I have flown business. A little way that I somehow make life sweet for myself.
the rainy season in California has made a super bloom happen here. So when my allergies are always bad every spring, I anticipated it to be especially bad coming back here from New York and yesterday was very tough for me but I had a wonderful day with my nephew. It was mainly just him and I because my sister had to run out to do maid of honor duties. She wasn't home last night. pretty much just gonna go with a natural look today. I'm gonna try something fun, okay? So I got a pony here, and honestly, this is already pretty good, but I would personally curl the pony for like a more romantic look. So I'm gonna pin it up, and I think that's gonna do for like an easy updo that just looks so fancy because of the braid. May each challenge you face blossom into opportunities of listening, protecting, and cherishing one another. Embrace this beginning of the rest of your lives together, hand in hand. I'm getting brunch slash lunch with my friend Chris. Oh, thank goodness for RC's dark glasses. My allergies have been terrible this week, so I'm not vlogging at all. I've been, I've been in a little bit of a slump, just feeling quite miserable to be honest with the pollen and the, the eye. I think I have allergy conjunctivitis as it's called, so just really, really sensitive to light. Go in the distance, don't need a reason A couple of people with mutual feelings I could be something that you could believe in Cause I'm never done when I'm done with you Cause you're giving me my baby My cat knows how to open the handle and pumpkin loves to eat flowers. So this is a contraption to prevent that from happening. And I heard that there's a lot of balloons in the garage. Yes. 
<laughs> Hello, good morning. This is what I'm wearing today because it's a lot colder and the white dress that I brought is not it's not suitable for today. So let me walk you down and show you the setup of the entire party as only a couple of guests have arrived. Today was really fun. It just went by in a big flash and I hope that you enjoyed the montage. My allergies weren't the worst and it was actually kind of consoling to see other people suffering from allergies. I was like, okay, we're in this together. Couldn't just John. And uh, thank you so much for watching this. I'm gonna close it out and say goodbye here. I had a lot of fun this week. It was also just very relaxing. And I'm gonna See you in the next one. Oh.